Jelly Bean Story Page, a heartwarming buffet surprise for veterans, Lucy and Charlie's last minute. One sunny Saturday morning, Lucy and her best friend Charlie were busy preparing for a special buffet. Lucy's uncles, who had served in the Army and Navy, were coming over, and so were some of their friends. Lucy wanted to show her uncles how much she appreciated their service, so she and Charlie had been planning this day for weeks. They decorated the backyard with flags and banners, set up tables with plates, utensils, and all kinds of delicious food. Their biggest pride, however, was the cake, an impressive three-layer vanilla cake with frosting in red, white, and blue. It had little edible stars and a topper that said, thank you for your service. They had worked hard with Lucy's mom to make it, and it was the perfect centerpiece for the buffet table. Just as they put the finishing touches on the setup, they decided to take a quick break before the guests arrived. They left everything ready, including the cake, and stepped inside for a glass of lemonade. But when they came back, they found a horrible surprise. The neighbor's dog, Max, had gotten into the backyard and was devouring the cake, frosting smeared all over his face. Oh no! Lucy cried. The cake! Charlie groaned. What are we going to do now? The party's about to start. Just then, Lucy's grandpa walked over, chuckling at the frosting-covered dog. Seems like Max wanted to join the buffet a bit early, he said, patting Lucy's shoulder. Lucy sighed. Grandpa, the cake was the most important part. We don't have time to bake another one. Grandpa thought for a moment, then smiled. Well, we may not have time to bake a whole cake, but maybe we don't need one. He led them inside to the kitchen and pulled out some ingredients from the pantry, whipped cream, strawberries, blueberries, and a few pre-made pound cakes they kept in the freezer. How about we make a layered trifle? It'll be colorful, delicious, and quick to put together. Charlie's face lit up. That's a great idea, Grandpa. We can layer it like the cake and even top it with some of the edible stars we saved. With Grandpa's help, Lucy and Charlie thawed the pound cakes, cut them into small squares, and layered them with whipped cream, strawberries, and blueberries in a large glass bowl. They worked quickly, and by the time they were finished, the trifle looked even more impressive than the original cake. When the uncles and their friends arrived, everyone admired the patriotic-themed buffet and loved the trifle. Lucy and Charlie shared the funny story about Max and the cake, and the guests laughed, appreciating the delicious last-minute save. Grandpa raised his glass, toasting to teamwork, quick thinking, and, of course, family. The buffet was a huge success, and Lucy and Charlie beamed with pride, knowing they had pulled off a wonderful day even with a few unexpected, helping pause, along the way.